Following this morning on WUPL, friends say a New Orleans rapper named Young Greatless was shot, was reportedly shot and killed overnight outside of a restaurant. Megan Key is live on the scene on Legion Fields where that shooting happened. And how much more? Cold if he ain't from the pole, it's cold. I'll come down here. Just go around here, get found here. Another bite turns, let me smile to a frown here. Ha, I'm getting tired of this lifestyle. At 30 with me, ain't nobody trying to fight now. A blind person, not a nigga up in sight now. Out the pipe, wanna make a goofy nigga bite down. That ice on me, blink, blow. They be like, wow, it's time to turn them nigga. No more Mr. Nice Guy. I'm from the home of Jambalaya, red beans and seafood, where the niggas will put the milli to your guts just to see food. See the red bean seafoods, and talent and on the block I have you swimming with the seafood. Get found with shrimp and nets and fishing poles. Nigga, this is how the story goes. Where well, you live and move fast, why well, live and move slow? And the key is still a key, and the O is still a O, O. And the nickel is still a nickel, but niggas forget the nickels and dimes, stop skipping. Hood acrobatics and focus upon your flipping. And for you niggas who like spitting, go and get you a job, cuz. This is a takeover, cosmetic flow. I'ma give rap a makeover. See, this here rap shit is my hustle. Skinny nigga, but whenever I spit, I move muscle. The Brock Lesnar rapper, this ain't no WWE. Me and my team sent trouble your way. Me and my niggas like the new NWA. And I'm a nigga with an attitude until I get a plaque or a hike in the mathematicals. I'm a radical and I feel like the whole world owe me, so I'm going to take this industry as collateral. What's good, YouTube family? Man, this your God bless one. Thank you for watching another episode of I Smoke Hip Hop. I'm sorry I don't, th I don't sound enthusiastic. I don't sound high energy. Man, we lost a good one, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I would like to announce we have another rapper who's been killed in 2018. The rapper from New Orleans by the name of Young Greatness has just been shot and killed early this morning outside a Waffle House. Man, Young Greatness, whose name is really Theodore Jones, he was fatally shot while outside the Waffle House in the 2900 blocks of Elaine Fields Avenue. It was early morning on Monday, and according to friends, things were looking kind of sketchy outside. And that's when one friend heard a couple of shots ring out and then tragedy struck the Young Greatness rapper. According to the New Orleans Police Department, man, the shooting occurred around 1.35 a.m. When officers arrived at the scene, there was another tragedy. They found a victim with a single gunshot wound. He was pronounced dead right there on the spot, ladies and gentlemen. Right there on the scene, he was pronounced dead. So most likely it, it was a fatal wound and it had to be somebody this person know because how do you get that close without knowing a person? I mean, this gotta stop, man. It's messed up. Some of his friends said he didn't even have beef like that. One of his friends told the news reporter on the Eyewitness News that you wouldn't even expect that um, coming happening with him. You know what I'm saying? He's one of the good guys. Dude wasn't into nothing but his music and his daughter. Wasn't into nothing else, man. That's what one of the friends said. And that's why, like, it's either somebody that knew him or somebody that was hating on him. Because according to the New Orleans Police Department, they said that they're looking for two suspects because Mr. Jones, who is Young Greatness, his vehicle also was stolen on the scene. That's some fucked up shit, period, man. How you gonna rob the nigga shit too after you take his life? Hey man, all you rappers, move the fuck out of your city. Your city doesn't have love for you. They got love for what you can do for them. They got love for your money. Yeah, they got love for this and that, the glamour and the glitz. These people don't fucking like you or rock with you. What are you doing still staying out here? God damn, man, this one is gonna hurt, man. Young Greatness was born in New Orleans. Then he moved down to Houston after Hurricane Katrina. Then he signed with Cash Money Records. Back in 2017, he signed with babies in them. And every body remember the, the great hit he had. Um, you know what I'm saying? Moolah. That was in 2015 and shit. When he All my life I hustle just to get that moolah. And stack my change, I'm going to see that jula. Stayed in the kitchen, the whip out that 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 whip out whip out that 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 whip out
in the GT switch. It's really fucked up, man, because you can see the greatness in this young man. And at the same time, I remember when Cash Money co-funders and that's Baby. And I remember when he said, man, this dude is going to be big. And he said things like he got grabs on Melody. He was one of the few artists that can have that. And it's like a lot of people was ecstatic and elated for this man. They said he's the sound of the future. And you can hear in his voice. His voice was very catchy. He, had, he didn't really need auto-tune like that because his voice sounded like an original auto-tune. He had that melodic flow that our future had. Or you can see a young thug. But he was bringing that New Orleans sound. And the, the, the cool thing about it, like, this nigga didn't even sound like he was from New Orleans. You listen to this nigga and how he rap, he sound like a up north rap. Let me say it better than this. He sound like a north, a uh, up north rapper that kind of like have a little bit styles from the south. Cause that's what what he sounded like to me. And you guys can listen to him too. And I just felt like you cutting a lot of these rappers' lives short based on what and for what. What is it worth? Man, this is tragedy, man. If you guys got any news on this information, man, Homicide Detective Brent Mathiff, he's leading the ongoing investigation, and he said he could be reached at 504-658-5300 with any information regarding this incident. Once again, if you feel like being this crime stopper, you want to put an end to this, it's, I'm not going to lie to you guys, I'm not putting my name on it, but at the same time, I feel like with my platform, the way it's growing, I need to do my dual diligence. And Homicide Detective Brett Mathis said his phone number is 504-658-5300. And you can give him any information leading to this. And you can call the Crime Stoppers information at 504-822-1111. Once again, that's 504-822-1111. That's the Crime Stopper number. It's a tragedy, man. I don't support the fuckery. I don't support the bullshit at all, man. It's, man, it's just not fair, man. I talk to my kids every day. I talk to my young associates every day. My brothers, my families. Hey, look alive out here, man. These are the jungles. The streets don't love you. Stop spreading that bullshit that niggas love to talk about. Oh, the streets gonna love me. This ain't paid in full. You know what I'm saying? When old boy talking about, you know, I feel the love. It's something about the street. That's bullshit. Number one, I'm not gonna be a hypocrite. I live in the suburbs now with my family, but at the same time, every day I'm up in the hood. I need to take my own fucking advice, but I understand, young... Young greatness, I really understand, man. The streets is contagious. It's not that you're doing dirt in the streets, but that surrounding in that element, you grew up in it, you get so acclimated into it, you don't realize that you're still stuck in it, and you don't have to be stuck in it. That's how addictive the street life is, and people don't even understand that, but you can't have your two foots in two different sides. Basically, you can't have a foot in the streets and a foot in the industry. Not saying that he was doing anything out there, but just saying, man, get away from it, man. Get away from it, man. I'm your guy, Bless One. Let's stop the madness. Man, 2018 been a fucking bad year for rappers. Rest in peace to Young Greatness, man. I'm gonna keep your name alive. I'm gonna really keep it alive. Rest in peace, Young Greatness. This crap, everybody say they know me, everybody laugh And ain't nobody made it tap it, everybody trap And everybody pulled up, so everybody fat Better get a gun, but they say PBT Them niggas, they ain't been for none I keep it on me, on my army, I ain't been to run I still up in my Gucci bag, but the biggest gun Show up a nigga, run up on me, I don't get a duck My flow's tighter than virgin, fuck with China I'm telling them I'm gonna make it, they look Hey, what's good to all my people out there, man? Thank you for supporting your boy's channel, man. If you want to donate something, if you got the funds, donate. If you ain't got the bread, just hit that like button, hit that notification button, and hit that subscribe button. Comment, share this video, and keep supporting this channel. Watch me grow to something big out here, man. I'm nothing without you guys. Peace.